Elon Musk just hired a group of young minds to lead the Department of Government Efficiency. One of them, a 21-year-old college student, is no ordinary genius. He cracked a problem that remained unsolved for centuries, deciphering ancient scrolls from the ruins of Pompeii. How he did that? Well, AI is the answer. And if he can decode history, imagine what he can do for government systems. Let's break it down. The problem is lost knowledge and burned scrolls. For centuries, historians have dreamed of reading the lost books of antiquity. When Mount Vesuvius erupted, it buried entire libraries in ash and heat, turning delicate papyrus scrolls into blackened, brittle lumps. These scrolls contain texts from ancient Rome and Greece, possibly works lost to time. But there's a problem. They are impossible to open. Unrolling them would destroy them. For decades, researchers tried various techniques, from x-rays to infrared scans, but nothing worked. Then AI came into play. The breakthrough is, AI reads history. Enter our guy, a university student from Nebraska. He wasn't a seasoned professor, nor a high-level researcher. Just a young man with a passion for history and AI. When he heard about a global competition to decode the scrolls, he jumped in. So, what was the challenge? The challenge was to use AI to detect ink hidden inside the scans of the burned scrolls. For months, the best minds in AI struggled to find even a single word. Then one Saturday night, while at a party, he got a message from his team, check the new scan. From his phone, he accessed his remote system, ran his algorithm, and then three Greek letters appeared on the screen. It worked. For the first time in history, someone had successfully extracted writing from these lost scrolls. The word he found? Purple. It was the first of many. Today, AI is reconstructing entire passages, reviving texts lost for 2,000 years. Why Elon Musk hired him? Elon Musk recognized something bigger here. If this young man could teach AI to detect patterns in ancient texts, imagine what he could do with modern problems like cutting waste, fraud, and inefficiency in government. The Department of Government Efficiency is not just another committee. Musk wants it to be a data-driven revolution. What's the goal here? The goal is to use AI to analyze spending, detect inefficiencies, and streamline operations at a level never seen before. It's not about politics, it's about logic. If an algorithm can reconstruct a lost civilization, why can't it rebuild a broken system? AI role in fixing government. Think about it, how much money does the government waste every year? How many outdated systems remain in place simply because that's how it's always been done? AI doesn't care about bureaucracy. It looks at patterns, numbers, and logic. Musk's vision is to create an automated, AI-powered government audit system, one that spots inefficiencies instantly, flags problems before they grow, and suggests optimizations based purely on data. That's why he chose people like this young man. Not politicians, not bureaucrats, problem solvers. The future is AI and human intelligence combined. Some fear AI. They think it's coming for jobs, for control. But in reality, AI is just a tool one that enhances human ability, not replaces it. This young man didn't sit back and let AI do all the work. He trained it, refined it, and guided it toward success. AI alone didn't decode the scrolls his persistence, creativity, and intelligence did. That's the key to the future. AI is not the enemy. It's the assistant, the accelerator, the force multiplier. Elon Musk knows that. That's why he's betting on young minds, fresh perspectives, and AI-driven solutions. The question is, will the system let them fix it? What do you think? Will AI-driven efficiency reform how governments work, or will it hit roadblocks from old-school institutions? Drop your thoughts in the comments. If you found this fascinating, hit like and subscribe, because we are just getting started. And let's keep learning together.